Greetings, crappie fishing friends. Welcome to Big Catch Fishing Mississippi. Sit back and enjoy some nice footage of live scope crappie eating jigs in the middle of summer. It's Mississippi slab hunting at its finest. I hope you enjoy. Let's get catching. There's a big old slab bluegill. That's what we're looking at. Look at that big old bull bluegill. He's got some sores on him, so I'm gonna let him go. Nice black crappie. So if it touches there, that's 12 inches. This dude right here is just at 13 inches. Black crappie. Just at 13 inches, right there. All right. There's one right under the boat. Oh my goodness. Right out, 10 and a half, almost 11. Black crappie, look at those shoulders. We're keeping this little guy. It's a good eating size. Ten feet out. <laughs> nice keeper size. Right at eleven inch black crappie. Keeping this one. Please hit the like button and be sure to subscribe. Look at this donkey. I just caught him. That thing's gotta be over five. Big old large mouth. One of his eyes is messed up. Big old fat toad. I saw it sitting there like a crappie. I was hoping it was a crappie. There's one. 14 feet out. Small one. Nah, he ain't too bad. I'm saying somewhere around 11, 11 inches. Shoot, that's 
suckers. It's too too fat to fit down in there. Nice one. Got it. Oh no, that's a problem. Damn it. <laughs> it's like 18 feet out. Get in this boat. That's what I'm talking about. It's right at 13 and a little bit over a quarter. Okay, you can see the cast just came 20 feet out, and you see the brush with some fish. The brush pile tops out about 8 feet deep. There's the weight and jig. A fish is following it. Didn't take it, though. And right about that time, I spotted that nice crappie right there. The jig and weight are right above it. He's looking at it and thinking about There's one right under the boat, 8 feet out. That's what I'm talking about. Get up in the boat. That's what we're looking for right there. Spider. Twelve and a half inch black crappie. Look at this thick sword. Black crappie, yes. There's one, 16 feet out. That's what I'm talking about, yes. Get in the boat. Black crappie. He does not want to be here. Look at that toad. 13 and a quarter black crappie. Look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Real feel heat index was over 100 by 10 in the morning, so I had to call it a day. Bessus was glad to go home too. Hot. I ended up with nine crappie that I kept. Considering the heat, I was very happy. So, let's get out started on the next day of fishing. There you see the jig dropping down. And you see the fish about 10 feet from the boat. There's the weight and jig right above the fish. He's looking at it. Boom! He ate it right there. Not even three feet deep. This is a nice crappie. The summertime fishing can be really, really good, but it can also be really, really tough. Oh, this is a nice, looks like a white crappie. And I believe this guy was almost 15 inches long. You can see the, uh, the mark right there. He was like 14 and three quarters of an inch. A toad of a white crappie. Look at that thing. Look how thick that sucker is. Man, that's a nice one. So I decided to let them go. When they're over 13, I don't even like to eat them normally. Okay, here's another cast. About 13 feet out from the boat, coming down to the brush pile there. You can see the weight and jig right above the brush pile. Boom, one of them hit it right there. Came up out of the brush. 
They were on fire. Yeah, this is another good one. This is a black crappie. And I was catching them on a white 8th ounce jig or 16th ounce jig with a blue pearl slab slayer grub by Bobby Garland. Yeah, I was letting them go today. Okay, there's another cast 20 feet out from the boat. It's about, the brush pile's about 12, the top's out in about 10 or 12 feet of water. There you see the jig and weight right above the brush pile. One of them came up and got it. He couldn't resist it. That is so much fun, I'm telling you. Especially when they thump it. The thump is real. My goodness, this is another nice black crappie. I was just kind of swimming the jig above the brush. Look at that sucker. 12 and a half inch black crappie. It's in the wintertime, normally I'm sniping individual fish, but in the brush piles, it's different. Now, this case, I did see those two fish. Now you see that one fish chased it down. So I targeted that specific fish and he ate it. Man, that's my favorite way to fish because you can really feel the thump most of the time and you're watching them hit it. That combination is just incredibly fun. So addictive. That's another really healthy black crappie. And thinking he's right at uh, that 12, 13 inch range. Oh, this one was 13 and a quarter. Look at that fat toad, healthy fish, beautiful. Let him go. Some of you might be saying, how can you let those fish go? I've got a freezer full. That's the only way. All right, there's a waiting jig 28 feet from the boat. Coming up on a nice looking crappie right there. Just over the top of him right there. he One of them peeled off. There were two of them. He's looking at it. Boom! He had to eat it. That was a nice one right there. And he sure enough got off. What a heartbreaker. Hey, thank you so much for watching today. God bless you. If you get the chance, get out there and go fishing soon.